Hi folks, Lady Shooting at Aquatic, so here we go. Huh. It's ninety-nine percent done. We'll start over here. Got these shifted over. A few minor tweaks here and there. So we finished. This is completely done. As well as this. I do not do need to add light because it's not as bright as it looks like on camera. And that requires brighter light. You guys are doing fantastic. I had some plants over here. We just fly trap. We'll eventually add more. As you see, there's some pretty good, good sized gaps here. I will make some um, V shaped stands basically. We'll cover these areas here what have you I am no carpenter so I'll do the best I can as you can see I got a little gap over there I said I am not a carpenter but I think it worked out pretty good for somebody who's never done it before if I turn on the slide you might actually see it there you go see it actually a little bit better oh I got a couple touch-ups here and there to do paint wise this thing worked out nicely Try to keep it more um, rustic looking, and I think I achieved that. Nice. Except for those few spots here and there. Oh well, it happens. But as I say, this corner hill is complete. Um, well, I think we'll adjust those lights again. So I can raise it up higher as long as it's not going to affect the growth of the plants, obviously. They're doing good. I still need to do a little clean up here and there. I shook the water up, so I did like a, a 90% water change. But yeah, it looks pretty decent. I mean, it's a start. Eventually, I'll get a real long pot for that. Eventually. And the board in the back is basically screwed into that board as well as got um, 3L brackets and it's connected on the sides as well so it's supported pretty good a little concerned on that part but um, I think we're good but this area is pretty much complete I'm going to clean up a little more clean up and dealing with this huge ass stain I got covered by a rug this rug will probably go away and we'll probably want to get like a 12 foot runner, 5 foot wide, maybe 6 foot. Once you get that crap out of here. Looks good. Potential new project down the road. These guys I just got, their lines are doing pretty decent. Like four of them out now, five of them out now. So not bad, not bad, not bad. Let's see, let's take a quick, sorry, I'm just going to do that fast. Yeah, so like I said, so we got stuff to clean up. These guys are doing fantastic. Growing very fast. And unfortunately, I do have some algae going in there, but I'll deal with that here very soon. I actually ended up raising the light, hoping that'll help uh, suppress that a little bit more. We'll see what happens. And this is definitely the next big project. This thing's gonna be 100% stripped down, scrubbed down, whole kit and caboodle. Since my HOB crashed on me, I just got a sponge filter, so I will have to get another HOB to a sponge filter. It's not gonna cut it. Down here, not doing bad, not doing bad. Ugly shoes. <laughs> Red fence are doing decent. Hopefully breed eventually. Get good over there. Blondie's um getting the show. Let's trip how slow he's been growing. We were seeing Al. Seems like he grew faster. I don't know, maybe in the genetics. 
But he's doing fantastic. He's everybody else in there. These guys here are still breeding. We'll have to get a hold of somebody. The next is me contact about um, giving some to him. Which will help immensely. Uh, oh, wow, yeah. These Bloody Marys, some of them are like almost black. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Big boys and girls. Very nice. Yeah, I'm starting to get a little bit of a snow issue going on in here. No big deal. I can fix that pretty quickly. Well, fairly quickly. Alright, so there we go. We'll call this 99% complete. This corner. We'll eventually get some more plants. Once we get them in at work. Alright, folks. Later.